हेलो स्टूडेंट्स माय नेम इज़ आलोक सेमवाल एंड टुडेज टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज ड्रग्स एक्टिंग ऑन एंडोक्राइन सिस्टम इन दिस लेक्चर आई विल डिस्कस इंट्रोडक्शन नॉमिन क्लेचर स्टीरियो केमिस्ट्री एंड क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ स्टेरॉइड्स A steroid is a biologically active organic compound with four fused rings arranged in a specific molecular configuration. These rings are designated as A, B, C, and D. Combinedly, these rings are composed of 17 carbon atoms. First three, A, B, and C, are six-membered cyclohexane rings. while d ring is a five membered cyclopentane ring steroids vary by the functional groups attached to this four ring core and by the oxidation state of the rings numbering starts from the first ring at this position and then various positions are indicated as indicated in this structure Sterol term is derived from steroids. Sterols are forms of steroids with a hydroxy group at position three, and a skeleton derived from cholestan. For example, cholesterol. Here you can see the structure of cholesterol with hydroxy group at position three. and a chain containing 8 carbons at 17th position next is nomenclature of steroids gonen is the term used for the nucleus of all steroids and sterols it is a tetracyclic hydrocarbon with no double bonds it is formally the parent compound of the steroids its carbon skeleton is called the steroid nucleus steroids are also named as steran or cyclo pentano per hydro phenanthrene steroids having two methyl groups and eight carbon side chain at 17th position are named as cholestan Next is stereochemistry of steroids. When the ring of any steroid contains different projections on the paper as in this figure, those groups which tend to lie below the plane of the paper are termed as alpha. And those groups which lies above the plane of the paper are termed as beta. For example, these hydrogens are below the plane of the paper and these are termed as alpha and these hydrogens are above the plane of the paper and termed as beta bonds and groups lying below the plane of the paper are indicated by broken lines and groups lying above the paper are denoted by solid lines now bonds or groups whose exact configuration is unknown are denoted by wavy lines steroids can be classified based on their chemical composition so the first category according to chemical composition of steroids is of cholestans when the two methyl groups and eight carbon side chains at c17 position are present the steroid is said to have a cholestan framework these compounds generally have 27 carbon atoms for example cholesterol 
Next category is of cholines. It is a triterpene which contains 24 carbon atoms. For example, cholic acid. Next one, androstan. Androstan is a C19 steroid with a gonane core. For example, testosterone. Next one, pregnans. It is also known as 17 beta ethyl androstan and it is a 21 carbon atom containing steroid. For example, progesterone. Next one, Astrains. Astrain is a C18 steroid derivative with a gonane core. For example, Estradiol. Next classification is based on the function of steroids. And last category is of Astrains. Astrain is a C18 steroid derivative with a gonane core. For example, estradiol. Steroids are also classified based on their functions. In this classification, different categories are first corticosteroids which are further classified in glucocorticoids and minocorticoids. Second category is of sex hormones which are further classified as progestogens, androgens and anabolic agents and estrogens. Corticosteroids are a class of steroid hormones that are produced in the adrenal cortex of adrenal gland. Glucocorticoids are a type of corticosteroid hormone that is very effective at reducing inflammation and suppressing the immune system. Examples include cortisol which is a natural glucocorticoid whose functions include immunosuppression. Other glucocorticoids are cortisone, hydrocortisone, prednisolone, betamethasone, and dexamethasone. Aldosterone is a mineral corticoid which helps to regulate blood pressure through water and electrolyte balance. Progesterone is a sex hormone which regulates cyclical changes in the endometrial of the uterus and maintains a pregnancy. Testosterone belongs to the category androgens and anabolic agents which contribute to the development and maintenance of male secondary sex characteristics. Nandrolone is a synthetic androgen and anabolic agent. Estriol, estrone, and estradiol are estrogens which contributes to the development and maintenance of female secondary sex characteristics. Example of synthetic estrogen is diethyl stilbestrol. So that's enough for today. In the next class, we will discuss detailed nomenclature classification with the structures and mode of action of steroids. Thank you.